Hey, what is up? And welcome back to the channel. Had some subscribers ask if that razor that we test drove the other day, if we actually ended up buying it. And the answer is yes. Could not be more excited. We've been looking for this thing for a while. Uh, this one actually just came up. It was down in Star Valley. So what, about 15 miles or so south of us here in Alpine, Wyoming. Lucked out. There's a family that is relocating to Minneapolis. And unfortunately, in Minneapolis, there aren't a lot of places to use the razor like there are out here. So we happened to see it. It was on Facebook Market place and we were over there at an art show just checking uh, Star Valley Ranch out and had a chance to test drive it and just super duper happy we were able to put a deal together he dropped it off a couple days later at our house uh, trailer trailered it down so um, everything worked out really well super happy there um, it's an XP4 1000 it is a 2022 it has uh, 1150 miles I think we've driven it about 50 miles or so it's got the 110 horsepower engine and it has opened up our world here tremendously um, where we usually just go hiking um, around uh, that from the house and take the dogs out in the evening for walks and stuff like that now we are heading out to various parts on the blm where we would either just uh, we'd usually just mountain bike out there or hike um, or whatnot and uh, now we were able to uh, drive out with the dogs and it is a lot a lot of fun um, we've got like i mentioned in a couple of the other videos we've got probably about 1500 to 2000 acres right out the door uh, even right here behind me you can see this is a path that takes us right out here towards the riverbed and when the river is low there are just a lot of spots to take uh, the UTV out. Um, if there is ever a place to use this thing, it is around here. Uh, we've also been using it to get groceries, go to the post office to get our mail, go check out the rental properties, things like that. Um, with the four doors, uh, a lot of utility there. We've got room for the dogs, as well as we've got the little bed in the back, uh, the little, I guess, pickup bed, whatever you want to call it, um, where we can uh, carry supplies or put groceries, things like that. Um, works out really, really well. Um, this thing, it will do 80 miles an hour. I don't know if we're gonna hit that. I think we have plenty of fun just at 20 to 25 miles an hour, so we haven't gotten super crazy yet. Uh, it does have on-demand four-wheel drive, but what I have found is that just um, heading up some of the trails here that are reasonably steep in two-wheel drive, this thing is just nuts. It is, it's crazy how much traction there is um, with the trailing um, arm suspension. Actually, I'm getting a lot more familiar with some of these terms, becoming a razor expert. This thing just soaks up bumps and um, just stuff in the road. Uh, <laughs> we've had to wash it off a whole bunch too. Just uh, we've been able to get muddy and whatnot, but just amazing how much traction this thing has. And uh, just really, really looking forward to driving around here. Um, just a lot of fun uh, just as far as the network of trails I mean there's literally there's hundreds of miles here we've had it up here Jordan Canyon up down below Ferry Peak uh, doing a little bit of rock crawling there so uh, anyhow just super enthused about this it's gonna be a lot of fun and uh, hopefully this will not go down as a really dumb purchase I don't think so anyway hopefully everyone's have a great day and we'll see you in the next one bye